leadership, community service, aerospace and STEM, emergency services, wingmanship. This is the Captain Bud Jackson Composite Squadron. Software in the Perseverance Rover by Cadet Airman Devon Mondal and Cadet Senior Airman Augustia Felagar. All right, so before we get started, we want to give you guys some background information. So what is software? So software can be defined as sets of instructions that tells a computer what to do. Uh, what's the Perseverance Rover? So it's an advanced and modern rover developed by NASA in order to look for signs of ancient life on Mars. And ever since that has landed, the rover has taken over 100,000 raw images. And obviously, in order to complete its tasks, it has heavily relied on software. Here's an image. Software used before the Perseverance rover. So before the uh, rover was created, software was used widely in space. One major example would be the Apollo Guidance Computer, which is a digital computer used in the Apollo program. The computer controlled the navigation, guidance, and control of another aspect of the spacecraft. The guidance computer used software written assembly language and was mostly unalterable. Parts of the software, however, could be overridden by astronauts. Uh, the development of this software for the Apollo guidance computer contributed greatly to the field of software engineering. So um, this slide provides an image of the Apollo guidance computer. Right, now let's talk about software that was used in the actual rover. So when we talk about navigation, we have the navigational and driving hazard avoidance software. So basically when the rover is traveling, a command will tell it what the end destination is. And using stereo imaging, which is using sound waves to create a perception of locality, the rover will determine the best path uh, using a path finding algorithm. And the hazard avoidance software essentially helps the rover avoid all obstacles and helps it conduct long drives. Here's an image or a model of what it looks like. So image compression software. So this algorithm was developed at the Jet Propulsion Laboratory and allows the Perseverance rover to return images to Earth. The software can take 12 megabit images and compress them to just one megabit, reducing their memory size. The algorithm can also divide the images into 30 pieces, reducing the possibility of losing an image. Uh, the, NASA time, the NASA team is able to get 12 times the amount of images with this compression software, lots of valuable data. Right, so we're almost at the end. And the main reason why we chose this topic is because space interests both of us. Uh, me, I was in the Mars Mission Smart Team, and Cadet uh, Senior Airman Caligarla was in the Java Smart Team, and it relates to both of our subgroups. So here are the sources we used in order to get our information. And yeah, so yeah, thanks for watching our presentation, and we hope you liked it.